Title, A Millionaire Left His Wallet on the Table T.O. Test the Waitress's Honesty He was shocked when he discovered that. Matthew Kane, a wealthy, successful businessman, had everything money could buy. From luxury cars to lavish estates, his wealth was limitless, but his trust in people was nearly non-existent. He'd built his empire from scratch, navigating betrayals, shady dealings, and broken promises. Over the years, he'd developed a hardened heart, seeing everyone as either a threat or an opportunity. But recently, his isolation had begun to weigh on him, leaving him questioning if genuine kindness or honesty still existed in the world around him. One chilly evening, Matthew decided to visit a small, unassuming diner on the outskirts of the city, far from his usual lavish haunts. It was a quaint spot, with vinyl booths and a simple charm that reminded him of his early days when money was tight, and he was just another young man trying to make it big. The waitress who approached him was young, polite, and wore a warm smile. Her name tag read Lily, and there was a spark of genuine kindness in her eyes. She treated every patron with equal respect and warmth, and her kindness seemed unaffected by Matthew's designer suit and expensive watch. As he ate his meal, a peculiar idea struck him. He was curious to see if the honesty and kindness that Lily showed were genuine or if she was just putting on an act, hoping for a generous tip. On a whim, he decided to leave his wallet on the table when he went to the restroom, wondering if she would take it. When Matthew returned from the restroom, he noticed his wallet was gone. At first, his heart raced, had she actually taken it? He scanned the room and saw Lily talking to another customer with the same friendly smile, as if nothing was out of the ordinary. Trying to remain inconspicuous, he sat back down and continued observing her interactions, noticing every detail with a growing sense of suspicion. After a few moments, Lily approached him, holding his wallet. Sir, I found this on the table. You must have left it by accident, she said, handing it back to him with a gentle smile. Matthew accepted it with a nod, feeling a mix of relief and disappointment. He had hoped for an opportunity to call her out, to confirm his suspicions that everyone had a price. Instead, she had proven herself honest, and his test had failed, at least for now. But just as he was about to leave, a thought crossed his mind. What if this first test hadn't revealed her true character? He decided to return the next day and try again, convinced that under different circumstances, she might reveal her true intentions. The following evening, Matthew returned to the diner, ordering a more elaborate meal and chatting with Lily about her life. She mentioned that she was putting herself through school and working double shifts to help her family. Her father had passed away recently, and her mother was sick, leaving her as the primary breadwinner. Despite her struggles, she spoke with optimism and warmth, never complaining about her situation. Once again, Matthew left his wallet on the table, excusing himself to make a phone call outside. He peered through the diner window, watching as Lily noticed the wallet. She glanced around, seemingly debating what to do, and Matthew felt a flicker of excitement. Maybe, under the pressure of her financial burdens, she would finally take it. But Lily simply placed the wallet behind the counter and served her customers as if nothing unusual had happened. When Matthew returned, she handed it to him once more, her expression unreadable but polite. Sir, you left this again. I figured you wouldn't want to lose it. Matthew thanked her, masking his frustration with a polite smile. How could she be so unwaveringly honest? Was she really this principled, or was it all an act?
Determined to find out, Matthew began visiting the diner regularly, testing Lily in various subtle ways. He left cash under his plate, forgot his watch, even slipped a check into the napkin holder. Each time, she returned the items without hesitation, never showing a hint of greed. Despite himself, Matthew was intrigued and couldn't help but admire her integrity. Then, one evening, as he sat in his usual booth, Matthew overheard a conversation between Lily and another waitress. They were talking about Lily's mother, whose health was deteriorating rapidly. Medical bills were piling up, and Lily was struggling to keep up with the expenses. She sounded worried, her voice breaking as she admitted she might have to drop out of school to care for her mother full-time. A wave of guilt washed over Matthew. Here he was, testing this young woman's honesty, while she was facing a life-altering crisis. That night, he left a hefty tip along with his usual test, hoping it would help her. But when he checked the receipt, he found that she had returned most of the money, only taking a small amount to cover the cost of his meal. This act of selflessness shattered Matthew's cynical beliefs. Lily had passed every test he'd thrown at her, and she had done so with grace, even as her own world was crumbling. Matthew was stunned, realizing that she was not only honest but also self-sacrificing. Touched and inspired, Matthew devised a plan to help Lily without damaging her pride. He knew that offering her money directly would likely offend her, so he came up with a different approach. He would pretend to be hiring a personal assistant and offer her the job, disguising his offer as a chance for career advancement. The next evening, he explained his proposition. Lily, I'm a businessman, and I see great potential in you. I need a reliable personal assistant, someone with integrity and dedication, qualities you clearly have. The pay would be much better than your job here, and you'd have a chance to learn new skills. What do you say? Lily was hesitant at first, worried that she lacked the qualifications. But Matthew reassured her, emphasizing that her honesty and work ethic were the only qualifications he needed. Eventually, she agreed, grateful for the opportunity but unaware of his true intentions. As weeks passed, Lily settled into her new role as Matthew's assistant, proving to be diligent and dependable. She managed his schedule, organized files, and quickly became an indispensable part of his daily life. For the first time in years, Matthew found himself trusting someone completely. But one day, while organizing his desk, Lily stumbled upon an old photograph hidden among some documents. It was a picture of her father, young and standing beside Matthew. Her heart skipped a beat as memories flooded back, her father had once been a businessman, but he had left that life behind to pursue a simpler life as a mechanic after a falling out with his business partner. Realizing the connection, Lily confronted Matthew, piecing together the story. Matthew admitted that her father had been his closest friend before they had a disagreement that ultimately led them down separate paths. He explained that her father had been one of the most principled people he'd known and that Lily's honesty had reminded him of his old friend's unwavering values. I wasn't sure at first, Matthew confessed, but when I saw the same integrity in you, I felt compelled to help. Lily was taken aback but also deeply touched. She felt a renewed sense of pride in her father's memory and was grateful to Matthew for the support he had given her, even if it had come through a series of tests. As Lily continued working for Matthew, she noticed changes in him. He became more compassionate and open-hearted, no longer the cynical millionaire she'd first met. Inspired by her influence, Matthew decided to use his wealth to help others. 
He began supporting charities, especially those focused on healthcare, and even created a scholarship fund for students who were struggling to pay for their education. One day, he asked Lily to help manage the foundation he had started, making her the director. Through her role, she was able to make a difference for countless others facing challenges similar to her own. With her mother's health improving due to the resources now at her disposal, Lily found herself at peace. She continued working alongside Matthew, not as an employee but as a trusted partner. Together, they made a formidable team, using Matthew's wealth and Lily's values to create a legacy that went beyond money, a legacy of compassion, integrity, and mutual respect. And though they never spoke of the tests again, both knew that those early days had been a turning point, not only for Lily but also for Matthew. His experiment to uncover honesty had ultimately revealed the truth about himself, that he, too, could be a person of integrity, capable of empathy and change. Years later, Lily looked back on her journey with gratitude. She had started as a waitress, uncertain of her future, and ended up as a guiding force behind a foundation that helped thousands. The tests had been difficult, but they had shaped her into the woman she was proud to be. As for Matthew, he finally felt a sense of fulfillment that no amount of money had ever brought him. He'd found honesty not just in Lily but in himself, proving that true wealth wasn't in his bank account but in the lives he could touch. The End